It's Hello from Inverness. Yes, I'm here at Grant Street Park, home of Inverness Clack uh, There's a friendly game today against Omnit and Primrose from the East of Scotland League Second Division. Arrived in plenty time, we were just speaking to the, uh, the chairman and uh, he said, you know, we won the round, so that's what I'm going to do. We won the round the ground, looking nice. The pitch is really looking good. I suppose they should at this time here, look at that, lovely. We've got a wee sort of raised bank in here, just at the dugouts. There we go. There we go, some good dugouts here. There's a park light on Charlie Kennedy. Home dugout. Yeah, so they've got this raised area here, and they've got a wee bit of Tennyson. Uh, and a wee covered area behind the, the goals. There's no start. Enclosure's called the night. 4748 Clean Sweep Enclosure. Very good, good view from up here. There we go, there's a flag of lovely loyal and tour. There's a tribute to Tally, I put Tally, 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 Tally. They've got a seated enclosure here, but I don't know if that's. It says they're home officials and away officials, so uh, but there's probably is some seating for the, for the public. I roll this up for away officials. Seating for the public, I'm sure that'd be a bit you can get in here as it ends. Thanks for taking the time to speak to me. Clark Nacudden, where does that name come from? Yeah, we're one of the oldest uh, clubs in the north. Uh, Clark Nacudden is Gaelic for Stone of the Tubs. It uh, goes back to when the folk were washing their, their clothes in the river nest and walked up to the town hall. Right. And there's a stone that uh, I believe is a granite stone that's got the, our name in Gaelic engraved in the stone around the cross at the town hall in the river So uh, that's us, kind of our history is. Uh, part of the fabric of the, the city, so it's gone back a, a long way and we're probably the only Gaelic name club in the UK if I'm right. Yeah, or in Venetian name, I think. Today. Yeah, I think it's most of the Gaelic community there, and, uh, that, that name is, it's, we've, we're, we're so proud of it. Uh, yeah. it's, 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 it is unique. Uh, yeah. And what about the season upcoming? I mean, um, you'll be looking to challenge the thing, is, is that a prospect? Yeah, we're, we're, what we're looking to do is develop a very young squad. We, we made that decision a couple of years ago to go with a, uh, Jordan McDonald came in as our manager and basis philosophy is we'll take the young squad that we have. We've got a very th we've got a thriving East Development uh, reserve squad so, uh, to get these young boys through. Uh, the majority have come through that, that pathway. Uh, and we're looking to develop them to get experience in the league. And that's going to take a couple of years and we all said that. But, Overall, that's the philosophy we have. We want to play football, we want to create an identity for Clark and give these young boys a chance. Um, so, yeah, it's, it's been, you know, it's been recognised, their, their abilities have been acknowledged by the clubs and uh, in the league. So, yeah, we want to keep them together and we want to push the club on. And they're quite impressed with the ground, it's a lovely big ground. Yeah. How are we encouraging people to come along? Is that a challenge to get people along to support? Yeah, I think we. Team? I think that playing in football, if your team's doing well, we, we, we like to play a certain brand of football. Uh, but you, you know, you've got to win games as well. We all know that. And uh, you think you get success, and I think potential for us to, you know, I will say we're the biggest club in the Highland League. Uh, our history, for one thing, and our potential to to grow. And I think that's where we are at the moment. We're not, we're not finished, certainly, from a long way off. So, yeah, we're going to push on, and we're going to. On and off the park, as you say, the facilities we want to look to improve it, you know, uh, as best we can. So, yeah. I'll be certainly looking out for the results, and thanks very much. Right, let's kick off. Just get in a position behind the dugouts. That's the first corner of the game to clack. Another 
going up. Pressure from Clark McCudden, but uh, no goals yet. Oh, the shot. Good save. Oh, there's a chance for Holmes down. Oh. That's the team's out for the second half and it's uh, quite a current in the white to kick off. Chance. Oh, short target. No, the break will be here. There's a guy there, there we go. Oh, good save. Oh, I should have been in. Oh, chance here. Oh, no, we're okay. Then. Corner. That'll be the first corner. Oh, well, team, but he's going. Yeah. There's a short target there, good save for the goalie. He's missed it, I think. Oh, good save again. That's it, full time. Inverness, Clack the Cudden 2, almost in putting those 0. Yeah, I thought almost in putting those 2 bit in the second half. Um, I mean, Clark the Cudden deserved their victory. They had something about seven or eight corners to almost the Primrose's one. 
uh, they had a lot more chances. But obviously they had a few chances in the second half. Uh, quite a good number of fans are high up in the second half there particularly. Almost in terms of the final they developed to break them down. At least to their credit they didn't just lob the ball up all the time. They were trying to play football. But after six, seven passes their attack would break down. Uh, so it was really penetration was the problem. But, you know, I also have to remind myself, Clark and Cudden are Tier 5 and Normanston are Tier 8, I think it is. So uh, that showed in the, the quality of football and the result. Well, that was my first visit to Grand Street, Street Park, uh, Greedy Ground. Uh, my second visit to Iron League uh, Ground, uh, Tier 5 of Scottish football. As I said. Please support me uh, by liking and sharing and uh, subscribe as well, I'd really appreciate it, and I'll see you behind the goals.